Hey, today is March 21st and we are at 4308. Uh, we're in Stone Creek and this is a three car garage, as you can see. And we can. Nice gate brings us in and this is that living room that I was talking about here so that second living room you'd be able to open those doors and get some nice cross breeze during the winter and this is a nice entrance The doors, nice tall doors, and with the hardwood floor. So we'll, we'll go the same way that I, I went the first time. So we'll come in to the right here, and you'll have the setup here, which is very nice with the, the closet. You have Looks like they had the same fans and crown molding. Well, this is a good size room. And then you have the bathroom for that room plus bathroom for the living room here. And then you have uh, plantation shutters. You have a nice TV area here, beautiful ceiling. This was the door outside that when we walked in the front door. And this particular garage is being used as storage, but it can easily get a convertible. It's air conditioned as well. And then you have your butlers. But I like the doors too, because they're all tall eight foot doors. And then you have some real nice crown molding. And, uh, and then this is the butlers area. And let's see. And I'll go over to the side over here. Since I'm on the side of the house, you have your second. So there's two, two zones. You have a laundry room, tall doors, nice laundry room, plenty of storage, plenty of counter space, which is nice. You get a sink tub. And then you have the full garage, two car garage, plus the third car garage. And then this is the looking back into the main. But you had a nice area here too, a nice entrance area with a nice light. And then it goes up coffers up even further and they have nice crown molding up there as well and off to the right in here was the another air handler so for another zone but you have the another guest room good size guest room but good good size closet walk-in closet here And a full bath, so an ensuite in here with the full bath. And the nice crown molding too with the same type of fan. And then out 
here, we have, we'll go to the right where the bathroom for the pool. A nice tall door. And this is the, the bathroom, the pool door. So I'll bring you out to the pool area. And then you have your water closet. This is a half bath. And then going into the kitchen, nice big kitchen area. Plenty of storage and a nice breakfast nook. A lot of light, natural light that comes in. It's quarter five right now and we have plenty of light that comes in, which is really nice. Crown molding. And I like too how they have different elevations on the top of the cabinets. And then if you're here, you have your natural gas. And if you're, you're here, you're able to look out at the pool area as well. And then look back to where your guests are in the dining room. They're just using that as a play area. With the light. And then you have um, more plantation shutters. And you can see they're, they're three quarters of the way shut and still a lot of light that comes in. And I'll just show you the outside and we'll be good. So on the other side is the uh, is the clubhouse. So it's nice, you're not looking at any other houses. So you got that view. And then you have an uh, entire house generator. This screen comes down and they have Skeeter Beater, which is that misting system that mists all around the, the house or all around the pool area keep the mosquitoes away and then you have these caps and the caps are for the uh, screen fence for the kids then you have the jacuzzi area and you have this southern exposure which is very nice and the the lake actually goes around the corner so you actually get a nice view back here and then you don't have any houses on the other side, which is which is nice. But that's the tennis court. So you can hear people playing over there. And then let me go you get privacy over here, and then this kind of goes down, and then goes all the way around. Nice big pool. And if you ever want to close that off, you certainly have more. As the kids get older, if you want to have more room, then you could do that certainly. And going into, I don't think we did the master is the last thing. So the master is beautiful. You got a big size master. So king size bed, but you have plenty of room with crown molding, nice tall ceilings. And then you have both uh, two, two real good sized closets with eight foot doors. So you have one here, then you have one on the other side. This is the way back out of the master. And then you have this and then, and then into the master bathroom 
itself. What a nice size shower. And his and hers. That's, I think, everything.